Hey you guys, I'm back in my regular Let's Play world, and this episode's not a normal episode, which is why it doesn't have a number, um, so it's probably gonna have a title like the future of our Let's Play. It's probably not even gonna be 10 minutes long, but, um, there's gonna be a lot of these, so I'm probably gonna number it number one, actually, just because I'm gonna be discussing plans. So, what I did was... I made my own version of a, um, combination door. And you guys are probably thinking, oh yeah, cool. No, I know how to make one of those. Well, I made my own version, which really isn't that great, and it is hilarious. It is so expensive, and, you know, sometimes it doesn't even work and stuff. So, you know, bear with me. Um, it's gonna take a lot of my redstone out. Um, and actually I have more redstone than coal again, so, whoopee, yay, um, you know, I don't think that it's that rare for that to happen, I just think it's fun. Um, so yeah, so, I finished the drill with Oster, which is why we're on it, and I'm not showing you my door, I'm gonna be showing you my door right after I show you the school this class. Really, I think this place is pretty cool. Um, it takes like I I should time this right actually. I'll time it sometime soon though. I'll, I'll do that and I'll tell you guys. So yeah, it takes a little bit, but you get to a really nice jungle that I'm not even sure is nice. It would be really cool if it was. My house is on an island. Everything's on an island. So. Whoa. That was <laughs> weird. I'll fix that. <laughs> so yeah, we're here. <laughs> um. Oh, I'll be sure to fix that. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, I had to put this torch here because I was stupid yesterday. Today. Sometimes I was really stupid. And I didn't bring enough redstone. I brought one redstone, so I'm like, oh crap, I need two. Please stay at places in the right spot. If I don't, I'm gonna be too mad. Actually, I wouldn't be mad. I didn't place it in the right spot. Anyways. So, I'm gonna show you guys, um, what I invented. Sorry about that. Um, what I invented. I'm sure it's been used before. This thing's crazy! It uses two T flip flop doors and it uses these things. These are sticky pistons, actually. So, let me just run you through how it works. So, these four buttons are connected, you know, the normal way, and then it sort of goes crazy so that I can connect them to a wider area so that I can make these little locks right here. And these little locks, this pushes the piston, and then this brings power through the sand block, through the piston, and then when the first one is powered, it powers the T flip flop, and then it goes and powers it, you know, and then it goes to the second one, where you need two sets of power, and I do realize that I can only do two for my combination, I really don't care at this point, um, I might fix that sometime soon. But anyways, it goes through this T-flip flop, turns it on, and then the second switch turns it off. Right? Yeah. The, the first one alone can't do it. I'll make some sort of piston thing so that it doesn't get messed up. So it's, like, hidden or something. I don't know. So then, it goes through here, and then it goes to another T-flip flop, which then opens the door. So let me show you guys how it works. And I'm going to be making this in my single-player survival world as soon as possible. Here, let's just see if I can do this. One, two. Yep, nothing happened. So that's good. That's actually really good. Because I thought that... Oh, nope. You can do it with just the two. I'll do something to fix that. I'll probably just put two pistons so then when, when these are powered, it'll get to another two flip flop so that the, um, things will be revealed. That makes it even more hidden. And, you know, I know that it's not necessary, and it's probably going to be problematic, because, problematic, is that the right word? 
Probably, it's probably just gonna be a problem. Yeah. Because, um, Minecraft's my Valentine's. Anyway, um, happy Valentine's Day, by the way. Um, <laughs> sorry. I'm all out of sorts. So, it might be a little problem because, you know, if I'm getting chased by a mob, I have to put in that input code. But what I might do is I might put an iron door. And then, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put an iron door with a pressure plate so that I can get in. Mobs can't. No, I'm gonna. Uh, oh my gosh. Probably just gonna do the pressure plate so that I have an extended amount of time to get away. And yeah. So, you know, here's the future of our let's play. Um. Don't tell me to make it cheaper. This is my design. Made it all by myself. No YouTube, no anything. Alright, so this concludes this episode of the future of our Let's Play, and I will see you guys later!